Welcome to the Canva Classroom, everybody. Today, we're gonna do a little magic. There is a key on your keyboard that looks like this. If you press it, it will do this and give you a magic search box. Look, you've got text and then different shapes here, including emojis. You've got different charts, graphics, photos, videos, your logos. It can even open grids. So I thought what I would do is go over a couple things and just test it out. If I click text, the text box pops up. That's great. Circle, square, there's a square. There's your heart. So when you click a chart, your chart thing pops up and you can connect it with Google Sheets or you could change the chart. If I click graphics, it gives some graphics. Let's type in gradient overlay. And look, I use this one all the time and change these to white. Well, let's just change them to black since we're on a white surface here. What about chalkboard? It automatically pulls it up in graphics if you click enter. But if you go down here and click photos, chalkboard, I could pull the logo from here instead of having to go to more and pull it from there. Open grids. So that just opens up grids for me. That will make it really simple for a color palette. Comment below, what do you think about this new upgrade in Canva? If you have any questions about Canva, leave them in the comments below. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you like today's tutorial and want to see more like it. Thanks so much for learning with me and I'll see you in the next video, which you can watch right now. Bye.